Alright, hey guys, Tave91 right here. So today I'm going to show you guys how to set up the Google Chromecast if you not have done so. Um, you just barely bought it like I have and stuff. So let's get to work and let's go ahead and set this up. Um, as you can see, um, once you plug in your Chromecast, which is back here, uh, you'll notice that you have to plug the, the Chromecast itself into the HDMI port, either one or two, doesn't matter. Um, and then you have to plug in the power cord that you got. Uh, if your TV does not come, you know, with a USB port, there's also the adapter, which is in my previous video, I explained that, that you can plug it up into, you can plug it into your wall. Um, so yeah, once you plug the USB cord into your TV, if you have, if you have the port for it, plug it in right there, if not plug it into your wall, then you have to plug into the, uh, Chromecast as well. Um, I tried to uh, use the Chromecast without the uh, without the power cord, but I guess you have to have it plugged in. Um, so I guess there's no sense in charging it. Uh, my mistake uh, in the previous video that I explained that maybe it runs on uh, without the cord. Um, but yeah, once you have that all plugged in, you come to this start screen where it tells you um, to set me up from a phone, tablet, or laptop. I mean, you go to the website if you're using the laptop. But um, instead of doing all that stuff, uh, I already pre-downloaded the app on my Android device, um, and it pretty much tells you, you know, where to set it up. Uh, it tells me my um, Wi-Fi, which is my home uh, base network. Um, then it says, "Let's set up Chromecast, whatever the number is." You'll be casting your favorite stuff in no time. So once it tells you that it's found the the Chromecast on your Android device or tablet or um, laptop, you'll start connecting to it. So as you can see, it's connecting right now. It can take about two minutes, if not maybe three, depending on your Wi-Fi connection. Uh, I have uh, the Xfinity, so it's kind of running okay. Um, as you can see on a TV, it tells you that um, it's waiting instructions, and you see a code right there. On your um, mobile devices or your device in general, it'll tell you that um, to, ch to check the code if there's a code right there. So you see that there's the same code right here and on the um, mobile device. So after you say that, you say you see the code. If you don't see the code, then you might have to check. As you can see right here, it tells you to change your name of the Chromecast. Uh, yeah, I don't want to have this basic thing, so we'll change it and we'll put, um, like, something simple. And then once you go ahead and do that, you go ahead and click Set Name. And then next it'll ask you for your Wi-Fi password. Um, I don't think you can really sync it, so you want to go ahead and type in your password, whatever that is, uh, since I'm only using one hand to record and also one hand to do this, I have to kind of take my time because I don't want to mess it up because I want the basic code that came with the um, internet. I'm planning on changing it. I'm not, I mean, I'm not going to make it something simple, but it's going to be something easy for me to understand. Um, Yeah, so guys, uh, what are you thinking about the Chromecast so far? I mean, are you guys enjoying it? Um, I know I explained in the previous video of uh, what you guys thought of it and stuff. Okay, now once you go ahead and type in your password, it's going to tell you that you're connecting to your Chromecast from your device to the Chromecast is in the back of your TV. Um, once that's all said and done, it should pretty much just let you start streaming uh, whatever. I'm still waiting for mine to connect as you can see right here. Um, but yeah, as I said, as to each their own, whether or not you want to go ahead and connect. Uh, it says, oh, it says my password was wrong, so I guess I have to retype in my password. Yeah, there can be a lot of mishaps, so make sure you get your password incorrectly. Um, otherwise than that, your Chromecast will not start. Um,
Yeah, it's gonna take probably a little bit. This, this is what I pretty much hate. Uh, your connection runs so slow when you're trying to connect other things. Okay, so it brings me back to the password. I'm going to have to retype in the password again. Um, I like how it informs you directly and it makes you feel like an idiot. And for me, I always have to show my password because I have to make sure I type it in correctly. Um, letters, numbers, all that jazz. Uh, now, what purposes are you guys using the Chromecast for? If you guys don't mind me asking. Uh, if you don't mind, let me know in the comment section below of what you guys are thinking about it. And there we go. Now I'm connecting. And hopefully this works because I had to show my password. <clears throat> and there you go. You are ready to cast. So it says get the latest apps and learn more about the Chromecast at Learn. Uh, you can either click um, Learn More and it will just take you to like a little guide. Uh, check out the backdrop in the background. That looks freaking awesome. I mean, it allows you to go ahead and um, change, um, you know, your backdrop. You can add, like, your photos and stuff. I mean, I like the basic stuff. Uh, and as you can see right here, once on your mobile device, it'll tell you whether, like, pretty much everything you need to know about the Chromecast, what you can use it for and what not to use it for. If you have um, streaming apps, if you go to your app store and stuff, you'll find all that um, on there. But once you're pretty much done, you can uh, start, um, I guess you're right here, the menu button. It tells you what to do. Um, once you do all that, you can pretty much uh, start streaming stuff. Like for me, I have my Netflix app on my phone. So I'm going to load that. And um, I mean, even though I've already seen uh, Daredevil, I watched all 13 episodes uh, that came out uh, and I was pretty happy with everything as you can see right here once you have all that you can um, I like uh, my favorite episode has to be episode 7 with Stick because that dude is badass as you can see right here it says um, it's setting up right there and in the top well, for me, it's my top right screen. You have a little streaming right there, that little button. Um, don't click the annotations and comment stuff. Click that button right there, and you it'll tell you if you want to play it on the Chromecast device. You go ahead and you click your name, and out of nowhere, there you go. You're having Netflix stream right to your see here at the bottom it tells you if you want to play it and you say yes and then bam there you go alright guys uh, this has been great and I think I'll probably watch this episode right now since it's my favorite episode <laughs> tell me what your guys favorite episode of Daredevil is in the comment section below uh, have you guys are are you guys caught up with the Daredevil series? Are you guys taking your time with it? I know a lot of people are because <laughs> this was pretty much a badass series. Let me know in the comment section below. Like the video, guys. Give me a thumbs up. Um, support my channel. Uh, and like I said, subscribe. And I'll see you guys later.